Hello friends, welcome back to my channel a few days ago, I uploaded a short video on TikTok and Instagram. You all liked it very much, and I am really thankful for your support. Many of you requested in the comments to make a full tutorial. So today, I will show you a very interesting project, an automatic fire extinguisher. In this project, we are using an Arduino Nano, a flame sensor, two servo motors, and a small water pump. Whenever the flame sensor detects fire, the servo motors will move towards that direction and the pump will spray water automatically. Please make sure to watch this video till the end. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel for more projects. In this video, I will explain everything step by step in detail. And if you don't understand anything, feel free to ask in the comments. So let's start today's project. First of all, I will fix the servo motor using glue, just like this. After that, we will take a flame sensor and fix it on top of the servo motor using glue. The flame sensor detects fire by sensing infrared light from the flame. By fixing it on top of the servo, the sensor can rotate and scan different directions. This helps to find where the fire is located. After that, we will place the second servo motor, which will carry the water pump, one step above the first servo, the one with the flame sensor. This way, water can directly target the flame. For this, I used an old battery as a base to fix the servo, but you can also use a small wooden piece if you want. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel for more projects. Your one like and comment motivates me to make more interesting projects. So please, let me know in the comments how you like this video. Now let's make the connections. Connect the flame sensor VCC pin to the breadboard VCC line, connect G and D to the ground line of the breadboard, and connect the out pin of the flame sensor to the A0 pin of the Arduino. After that, take the first servo motor on which the flame sensor is fixed. Connect the VCC wire of the servo to the VCC line of the breadboard, connect the GND wire to the ground line of the breadboard, and connect the signal wire of the servo to pin D9 of the Arduino. Now take the second servo motor on which the water pump is fixed. Connect the VCC wire of the servo to the VCC line of the breadboard, connect the GND wire to the ground line of the breadboard, and connect the signal wire of the servo to pin D10 of the Arduino. Relay module VCC wire to the VCC line of the breadboard, connect the GND wire to the ground line of the breadboard, and connect the IN wire of the relay module to pin D8 of the Arduino.